Hi guys, well welcome back to Allotment Diggers. Well, uh, I took 15 minutes out of my day today to do a survey. Um, it's called the Big Butterfly Count. Now it runs from, uh, hang on, let's have a look. I've got the thing here. It runs from the, the 20th of July until the 12th of August, okay? And um, if you want to take part yourself, all you have to do is type in www.bigbutterflycount.org um, and there's a picture that you download. Let me show you the picture. Okay, so you downloaded that picture. Now then, what it asks you to do is to go on your allotment, go into a meadow at the side of your house or in your garden, spend 15 minutes um, counting all the different varieties of butterflies. Okay? So we did that a little bit earlier and um, with a considerable amount of different butterflies on this allotment that is actually recorded. And um, I filled the, the thing and I've sent the what I've what I've seen um, back to him and basically what it is is to get a bigger picture of where the butterflies are what butterflies there are uh, around the UK now um, as you saw there on the draw I think there's about 17 butterflies and there's a couple of moths as well uh, we didn't record that many to be quite honest with you we, we, we recorded quite a few uh, there was a few that we saw but we couldn't catch on camera it was just too fast and um, well, I'm going to be showing you um, some of the a video of some of the the actual um, butterflies that we actually recorded. But um, the ones we didn't was the small copper, um, the red admiral, and um, um, the, the the small tortoise shell. Okay, they're the ones what we didn't record. Um, however, we recorded the three main butterflies. Everyone seems to think they're all the same butterfly. You know, the cabbage white, but they're not and there's slightly differences in the three which I'm going to tell you about now you've got the large white, you've got the small white and uh, you've got the green veined white now the difference between the the large and the small um, is um, when the, the butterfly's got its wings closed the small white has a more of a yellowy underside whereas um, the the big white it's more of a whitey um, um, on its on, on its under its wings and um, the the big white has a, a more prominent black marks on the tips of the wings but um, the the green vein white it's, it's just white butterfly with um, and you can see like green veins all the way through it um, and we've got all three of them and I've recorded all three of them on the allotments today um, the ones what I, the others are the gatekeeper. We recorded that. I've, obviously, I've got the I've got this thing here, so I'm just telling you which ones we've ever recorded. Um, the speckle wood. Now I've got a load of speckle woods right behind the back of me me allotment, and um, so there was quite a few of them down there. We've we've only managed to catch one or two of them though because they move like lightning. Uh, we also um, uh, got a, a, got um, the comma. That's C O M M A comma. Um, we recorded that. Um, what else did we record? Oh, the peacock. Yeah, then now there's a w wicked butterfly. We recorded one of them as well. Uh, we obviously the the common blue and uh, the ollie blue as well. We recorded uh, a couple of them. They're too fast, really. To to uh, and I had great difficulty in, in catching them um, and getting the camera focused properly but I assure you the ones what we recorded is what I've just said there we actually did record them um, I think that's it really uh, and, oh did I, say, did I say the painted lady I don't know if I did say the painted lady no I want the painted lady no we didn't record that I'm just looking at the one it's a goalkeeper above that so yeah that's that's what we, uh, re we recorded today the ones what I've just mentioned we we did see but we haven't recorded so anyway uh, I threw a, a, put a video up. It took me 15 minutes to do the survey. It took me about three hours to record all these um, these butterflies. What they say don't work with animals and children. Well, they're absolutely right. It's absolute. It was a nightmare. It was hard work um, recording them. I had the camera in my hand, so it's a bit of shaky work going on. But you get the idea. You will get to see them. And um, so here's the here's a little clip now of the the butterflies which I've recorded today on the allotment. Well guys, what you're looking at there is called a speckled wood, a beautiful butterfly and uh, like I say it's here on, on the allotments just behind me plot it is on um, 
on a, on a piece of rhubarb. Of a, or any, of, if, you, if you don't believe where we are, I'm just going to flip the camera up now and show you. Swing the camera around. There you go, there's the old flag. So it's just behind me plot, it flew on me plot and uh, <laughs> it, it it disappeared over there so it was on my plot when I first chased it but you know we're doing a bit of butterfly chasing today anyway so that was the um, that was the the speckled wood lovely little uh, butterfly let's oh, move that's on that's a small white there guys um, we're looking for the the large white now, that was a small the white. gatekeeper there guys. See the dot, the, the, the spot on the top of its wing? Absolutely, can't keep the camera still. Yep, it's uh, definitely the gate, a gate, the gatekeeper. There it is. And little buggers flew off, where are you? There it is. I'm trying to get it to, so it can open its wings, but yeah, it's gone over that in that direction. Yeah, a geek gatekeeper, excellent. Well, well, tough with Well, guys, here's a little Ollie Blue. Look at that, absolutely wonderful. I've not seen one of them for oh, god knows how long. Um, I think it's the Ollie Blue, it could be the Common Blue. No, it's, it's too pale, it's definitely the Ollie Blue. Absolutely beautiful little butterfly. There you go. One of the butterflies that we've got on the, the allotment. Absolutely wonderful. I'm absolutely chuffed as a monkey with a bag of nuts seeing that little darling, and it's gone. Oh, there we go. Well, there's the large white there. That's the large white. Been trying to get that all day. Well, and there we go. Absolutely awesome. And I've counted about six or seven of them. What you're looking at there is a small white. Um, the reason why you can tell us the, that it is a small white is because of the um, the yellow tint underneath its wings. And um, I can see just through the the fence there. Um, it's the uh, the green veined white. And where's it? There it is. That's the green veined white there. So we've got the green veined white. There, guys, a little uh, peacock, a uh, beautiful little butterfly. Absolutely awesome. Oh, I've disturbed it. Oh, well, it's it's come back. Excellent. Although I've actually seen a comma as well, a comma. Uh, let's move out of the way. There it is. There. There you go. There you go. That's a comma. Spelt C-O-M-M-A. Oops, get the camera pointing at it. Absolutely wonderful. Beautiful little butterfly. Well, look at that there guys, that's what you call a speckled wood. Beautiful little butterfly on the apples there. And what it's doing, it's uh, eating the the juices of the apple. It's gone, unfortunately, but uh, you did see oh, it. a little common blue butterfly there. And uh, does it look beautiful? That's the common blue. Absolutely well, outstanding. Um, three crickets um, squaring up to each other. I uh, could hear a commotion and I looked down and I just spotted them. And uh, there they are. <laughs> There's the result. You can hear them everywhere, these things. But yeah, little crickets, Jimmy Cricket. So there you go, some beautiful butterflies. Did you see the. Um well, it's a debate, crickets or grasshoppers. I think I always know them as grasshoppers, but um, yeah, they're the, the UK's uh, grasshopper. They're not these bloody big things which um, eat everything in sight, although I suppose these will eat uh, a fair share of food. But they're not a problem, um, the 
the grasshoppers or crickets, whatever you, actually not a cricket, it's a grasshopper. I just realised, because I, I, the, the crickets are slightly different. Um, anyway, yeah, that, that I thought I'd show you them as well. We wondered what was making a noise, and blow me, there they were, these crickets, uh, giving it some, or, or, I said it again, didn't I? Um, these grasshoppers. So there you go, that's what we've been doing. That's my 15 minutes uh, of, um, of work done today and um, like I say if you want to take part in the survey just go and download the link I'll leave it below and uh, let me know if you've um, seen any of these um, these butterflies yourself what I would be interested to know is if any of you have seen any of the brimstones or the marbled whites they're the ones what I'd love to see and uh, I'd actually spend a few hours to drive in the car down to just to have a look at them because uh, years ago we used to see a lot of them on the allotments but we've not I've not seen them in, in 25 years so I'd like to know if anyone's seen them um, locally and basically um, I've seen them at all around the UK anyway that's it for this one I hope you enjoyed the, the look at the butterflies and uh, like I say um, if you want to have a crack at this um, this survey um, you'd be doing um, the wildlife in in the UK a big big favour. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed the uh, the, the look at the the butterflies. Um, we'll be back to normal next next week. So thanks for watching, and uh, see you real soon.